Hey guys, it's your boy if you're back with more Mahal Feature Bite content and today's video, first of all, my apologies for not posting any videos. I'm not at my home setup, so I'm really sorry that the videos are so uncertain and so delayed. Anyways, so this video is about Hyperion, okay. He is, I'm gonna tell you right now, he's better than Wanda. But there is a catch, there is a reason why you don't want to build Hyperion and actually it could be a waste of uh, materials for, for him. Anyways. For the stats, we have these no Odin's blessings, nothing. All stats are gapped out though. Universal type enhancement rank 3, overtime stage 12. And we have the we do have this artifact, but you can see it's justice. He's order. So basically, this artifact is useless. Apart from the passive that he's getting from his own artifact, which is the 10% ignore dodge, but that's gonna be like negligible. It's not even gonna help. CDB of rage, and then we have a mythic uniform with these uniform options. HP you want because the fifth skill now again I don't like this accumulation but the fifth skill is damage taken accumulation which is alright we'll talk about the rotation in a bit and the tier 3 skill also creates some issues but that's alright. For the cards we are talking about 129.4% energy attack on the cards but it will be the same if you have about 110 close to that or maybe 130 is the same score. So. Uh, the rotation is very very simple okay so the fourth skill you need to cancel the fourth skill right after he does this you can cancel that you don't have to uh, let it run uh, the fifth skill of course is the money maker this is you don't want to cancel that cancel that here if you want if you want that let it run full third skill will cancel here okay so we'll go three cancel four cancel five get the proc on the fifth skill two beam then the first skill you have to run around for a, a second or something 3 cancel, 4 cancel, 5, boom, and then the tier 3 skill, okay. You have to use the 5th skill, do not cancel that please because otherwise you will miss the accumulation and everything as well. Then again, we can go start with the 3, 4, 5, 2, 1 again. It's gonna be the same rotation, once more before we go into the run, it's gonna be 3, cancel 4 here and into the 5, it does pretty ch a nice chunk of damage actually, 2, cancel 1, Wait a second or so, uh, 3 cancel, 4 cancel, 5, get the accumulation, get the proc, get the damage into the tier 3 skill and then you can use the f uh, second skill if your proc is late but Hyperion I would say is way more consistent than Wanda and I've, I have never, I didn't, I never actually had late procs on Hyperion. Early procs can be possible because of the tier 3 skill but anyways let's go for the run. So let's start it. 3 cancel, 4 cancel, 5, a little bit late proc but that's alright, we'll go into the second skill, into the first skill and then 3 cancel, 4 cancel, 5, he's gonna get hit and now the tier 3 skill and this is the issue, after this one the lava plum, it can, you can see it did activate the proc a bit early so that can actually happen which is uh, sometimes it's kind of annoying, it does happen but you cannot really control everything right, 3 cancel, 4 cancel, 5, Get the hit, tier 3 skill, and then I'll, I'm gonna wait. 3 cancel, 4 cancel, 5, get hit, get the accumulation, and get the score up. So he's very easy to use, uh, way easier than Wanda, and the timings are very, very easy to manipulate. You can make changes to the rotation if you want, but it's a very simple rotation. Unlike Wanda, you have to skip some skills because of the cooldown stuff. So everything works amazing with Hyperion. The only thing that why, you know, as to why is it is actually not worth building Hyperion. Even though he's meta and I, I think he's meta for sure. He's better than Wanda. Uh, for one season at least, we'll see about the other seasons. I think he's gonna be better than Wanda for the paralysis as well because he can paralyze easily. But the, the thing is that uh, the score difference is not that huge. Uh, he is better than Wanda with a rage but not with a judgment. So if somebody, okay, I think you can uh, hear some of the birds chirping I think right now. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> so the thing is that uh, because uh, he the score difference is not much, like it's not a lot it will be maybe it will be noticeable depending on your runs and everything because i think you can have better runs with him than wanda but there is one more issue wanda is damage dealt accumulation i believe so and he is damage taken so his 
score will a lot of times depend on the beast's positions and if he hits you properly or not so you have to time it. it's gonna be the crescent scenario but he's gonna be way better than score in actually scoring than crescent because of the ease of the procs and everything because he's gonna be very very consistent but even about that uh, if you want to build hyperion you can because i think he at least is gonna be meta for burn and paralysis we'll see paralysis how that goes but i think he will be meta uh, other than that i think it just depends if you like to play this character or not he's good in pvp uh, definitely way better than wanda i believe so but it's on you you can build it or you can skip it okay uh, with that Wanda that, I, uh, that I'm gonna be showing you after this one, I'll show the artifact on that Wanda. I was able to do 9.7 on the first run. So maybe I can push about 9.8 on that Wanda. And this is gonna be, I'm not sure, this was not even the best run. I can score about 200k or so plus on this account. See, look at that. He went there and look at that. I will not be able to, I did not accumulate anything when I use the fifth skill. So he's gonna be so much accumulate dependent just like crescent is and we're going to be starting uh ending up with about 9.04 million i can easily go about 9.3 i think with my hyperion on this account without any of his blessings this has order as well as the pure evil the pure evil i've heard and i think works in abx i will be doing a testing video maybe this one the order and the nine percent would have been a better option to put on hyperion but this one is actually for uh for pvp because of the passive and everything but there's nothing i would say flawless in that so it's on you if you guys want to build hyperion go for it i would say stick with wanda because it's not a huge difference let me know in the comment section what you think about that and as always if you do enjoy the content i hope to see you again take care i'll see you all in the next one